This video is about how to prepare your Hemotech membrane feeding system for blood feeding. Some of the supplies you'll need to get started are a Hemotech membrane feeding system, PS6 power unit, FU1 feeders with reservoirs, plastic plugs, black o-rings, a 10 milliliter syringe with needles, parafilm, and defibrinated calf blood. First start by inserting the plastic plugs into the bottom of the holes of the reservoir. Then assemble the needle onto the syringe and extract the amount of blood needed for feeding. The amount of blood used in the reservoir will vary on the amount of mosquitoes you are feeding. Small cages can be given 1 to 2 milliliters of blood, while larger cages can be given 3 milliliters of blood. Using the syringe, fill the reservoir with the defibrinated calf blood. Next, you'll need to cut out a piece of parafoam that is large enough to cover your reservoir and rub this piece onto your skin to obtain human scent. Make sure that the user is not wearing any scented lotions or perfumes as it could interfere with the feeding process. Then stretch the parafilm over the reservoir with the human scented side facing out. Make sure not to stretch too thin as it can melt or tear when warmed up. Then secure the parafilm with the black o-ring. Once your reservoir is set up, plug in your feeder and screw the reservoir into the power unit. Make sure not to screw the reservoir too tight onto the power unit as it could be difficult to remove when cleaning up. From here, the feeder is now ready to use. Clean the reservoirs, unscrew them from the power unit, and remove the parafilm, o-ring, and plugs. To remove the plugs, use the plug extract tool to push them out from the top of the reservoir. To clean, rinse all parts using DI water. 